Hi everyone. Well, we've got Bishop Ruth coming on Sunday. Super excited about our Bishop, the Bishop of Horsham, coming to see us on Sunday morning at 9 and 11 a.m. Uh, both services are going to be really special. So I do hope you'll join us. Come, come to both. Come to both. Do a double, a double helping of church on Sunday morning. Um, communion at, uh, at 9 a.m. Uh, with the bishop preaching. And then uh, at 11, it's baptisms and confirmation. We have got 13 candidates, 13 people uh, being uh, some baptised and some confirmed. Uh, well, 12 out of 13 confirmed. So it's going to be a really, really special morning. We're really looking forward to that. And uh, please be praying for those candidates as they come to make that public declaration. Uh, and the bishop puts her hands, lays her hands on each one on their heads and praise for the Holy Spirit to fill them afresh. We're praying that will be such a powerful moment. Here's the prayer. I've got the liturgy out here. Here's the prayer that the bishop will pray uh, over those candidates. Almighty and ever living God, you have given these your servants new birth in baptism by water and the spirit and have forgiven all their sins. Isn't that amazing to be able to declare over each one that Jesus has forgiven them all their sins because of what he's done for them on the cross. It, it's amazing. And this is, you know, this is true for each one of us. Um, let your Holy Spirit rest upon them. The spirit of wisdom and understanding, the spirit of counsel and inward strength, the spirit of knowledge and true godliness. And let their delight be in the fear of the Lord. Amen. Amen. Well, let's be praying that prayer for our candidates as we build up to Sunday and let's see the Holy Spirit come, come upon us, not just the candidates, but come upon us all as we are filled afresh and equipped to serve God and to be his servants out in the world that so needs to know God's love. So, yeah, come Holy Spirit. That's our prayer. See you on Sunday.